All right, hello and welcome back. I'm the Amateur Guy, and we are playing The Outer Worlds. Let's get to it. I just uh, watched uh, The Atom Project last night with my wife, and it was kind of cute. It wasn't, it wasn't horrible. That's, uh, what's his name, Ryan Reynolds. Uh, goes back in time, or goes forward in time, and meets, uh, ooh, I was going to come in here, and I was going to mod my weapons. And meets, like, his younger self, and I don't want to give it away. Let's see, anything to repair? No, I can tinker modify. Let's see, I mean, Magnum. Do I already have current magazine mod? Shock, DPS. I have mag to zap on there. Wow, that really brings up the damage, I think. Wait a minute. Okay, wait, that brings it up. It brings up <laughs> DPM. Damage per minute. Round per minute. I think it's better. I'm pretty sure that's better. Damage per minute is way up. Uh, hang on. Damage per second. The, the bottom one doesn't have damage per second. It's got damage per minute. Alright, let's install it. You know what? Whatever. Let's just do it. This one. I have no mods. Gyrosite. Point range weapon spread minus... I currently have Extendo site, which I really like. Super Scope 2000. A 6x zoom scope to the weapon. You can't even get 6x range. Like, shit just doesn't appear at 6x. If I have a different gun, I'll do that. LMG. Nothing. Sawed off shotgun really needs something, but I have nothing. Alright, let's go to Tinker. Uh, let's see how expensive it is. LMG, I can definitely crank up. But of course, after spending all this money. Wow. And this is already, because level 7, already expensive. I think I'm going to leave that. I was going to give this to uh, Lavardi. Let's do that. This is, these are the only weapons I can break down. Go ahead and break that down. I'm not ready to dump the shock cannon yet. Alright, let me go here. 172, 104. Whoa. Okay. Grenade launcher. I don't have any... I don't think I'm carrying any armor. Well, apparently not. Because if I had armor, it would show up here. She is not ready for a level up. Okay, this was the behavior. Distance... Weapons mixed, defensive, aggressive, what's passive? Only attacks targets the companion has explicitly told to. And then only told to attack a target if the companion continues. Once once told it, the companion continues to fight until the combat is over. <coughs> Uh, excuse me. I could have her just use ranged, but no, mixed. 
Not close, definitely not close, not far, medium. I, I hate these three choices. There should be like, hey, if I start attacking shit, you start attacking shit. That kind of thing. All right. You got anything for me? Uh, I don't think I'm overweight. Uh, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, I don't need to do this. Let's just, uh... Wait, journal. Die robot. Where's that at? Why am I not seeing that? That robot is at the geothermal plant, but for some reason, let me just make sure. Okay, this is this is the geothermal plant here. Yeah, this would have been a not a great place to fast travel to. Alright, Pavardi. Let's, uh... Psh, yeah, this is gonna have to be it. Let's kick some butt. So I should be able to accomplish two things at the same time. Easter's choice. The control room should be off to the right. I hope. Let's see. Let me go through this stuff. Wait, I only want uh, this stuff. Okay. Yep. 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 Uh, yeah, we can sell that. Yeah, we can sell that. Tactical time dilation recharge 15 seconds. Yeah, or 50%. I'll take it. All right, that's all. We're doing the right thing. We don't even know what we're doing yet, Bavardi. Welcome. Why is it pointing to me out here? All right, I'm going out, but I'm not sure why, because it's probably going to point me right back in. Yeah, see? It's lying. Maybe I needed to go out and in just to fix the pointer. Nope, the pointer's just screwed. Hang on. I just, I, I... Wait a minute. Why is it saying... This is not me. This is where the logic module is. Why do I feel like an idiot? I couldn't have picked up the logic module. I'm sorry. This is my ship.
What the heck is going on? It's 30 meters underground from here? Something is goofed up. Something is wrong. Do I look at the map? Yeah, I'm right on top of it. It's 30 meters underground from here. Let's just... Uh, you deliver Reed's message, blah, 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 blah. Powers routed away from and travel to the region's geothermal. Well, these both say redirect the power. Also pointing right here. This is this has just got to be a glitch. I don't know what I did to screw this up. But I have no way to go. Yeah, it's saying geothermal plant 430 that way. But I look on the map, and that's just where my ship's at. Maybe it'll fix itself. For now, I will just kill everything in here because this is the geothermal power plant. Come on, buddy. You gotta look at me so I can kill you. Check upstairs. Wow, you got that? Yeah, it was really expensive. I hope there's something worthwhile up here. All right, we'll use the terminal. <laughs> Uh, messages from Spacer's Choice. This letter serves as an informational notification of our company's displeasure toward your management of the Emerald Vale Geothermal Plant for reasons related to exceeding your staff budget in your latest quarterly report. Please select five subordinates to be dismissed immediately. Wow. Uh, let's go to the next one. To the esteemed members of the Emerald Val Development and Oversight Committee, I hope this letter finds you wealthy instead of well. After due consideration, your last five identified and terminated no fewer than five subordinates who were unable to provide sufficient justification for their ongoing employment. Wow, that is so awful. Oh, uh, wait, I read this. I read this. Wait. We have investigated the claims made against the profitability of the Greater Emberville region. Our offices agree with you. Agriculture, fishing, canning have experienced a steady decline, while the Emerald Vale geothermal plant remains somewhat profitable. Our offices are currently investigating ways to implement additional cost-saving measures, which will ultimately lead to a leaner, more streamlined, more efficient geothermal power plant. Uh... Okay, let me just, uh, 
I just want to... Yeah, I read everything. Okay. So they're scumbags. I don't think that comes as a shock. Alright, no exit from here. Oh, hang on, I didn't have to, well... I mean, other than getting the information out of that room, I didn't... There was nothing useful in there. Alright, so upstairs cleared. Whoa! This is where I came from. No, this is not where I came from. I came from here. Alright, let's check here. Ooh, what's this? good okay so I'm sure something right in the center is use terminal plant status uh, Emerald Bell Geothermal Plant operating at 22% efficiency. Power is currently being distributed to Edgewater, Saltuna Cannery, and Botanical Laboratory. I'm redirecting power. Warning. Safety failures detected. High likelihood of moderate to severe structural damage. Redirecting power. Irreversible. Manual override require. Please activate all three electrical track switches. Okay. So, are you still putting me out of this place or what? Did you finally figure it out? Three switches. That'll be easy enough. I'd like to find out why it, it's still pointing me out of the building. Okay, so I've gone upstairs. I've checked this main floor. Uh, but I think there's a door back here, isn't there? I thought I saw a door back here. Yeah, this exits me out of the building. Oh. Okay, he's not he's not currently a bad guy. Let me guess. Holy schmoly. That one's gonna cost 70. Come on now. Uh. <clears throat> Unlocked door. Passcodes. Baser Thompson. I don't know why I was able to do that. Okay, personnel logs. <clears throat> Quest updated. Cool. Chester Higgins again. That hull head. Found him fiddling around with one of the mechanicals, so I had to write him up for tampering with company property. Just in case I'm reading this a couple of days from now. Feeling bad for what I've done. I'm. Let me just remind myself that I've warned him before. It's always been a little crooked in the skull.
Doesn't sit right with me. The company's been replacing our guards with auto mechanicals at this rate. I'm going to end up a chief of security with no staff. Uh. Oh. Personnel log. Worst has happened. Mechanical's gone crazy. Locked myself down here just trying to gather my courage. Gonna make a mad dash for the control room. Might be able to shut things down. We'll delete this entry if I ever return. Greeting security chief Tanaka. This is an automated message indicating by indicated initiated by spacers choice worker safety contingency protocols a security lockdown has been initiated this is not a test your behavior during this lockdown will be reviewed during your quarterly audit anxiety is a common side effect of light threatening situations engendered by a security lockdown fight back against anxiety with an ice cold bottle of zero g brew zero g brew an ale that's good for what ails you Okay, let's just exit. So, uh huh. But it didn't unlock this door, did it? No. It unlocked this door. I gotta get in that door. So the robo robots have gone nuts. I would. Direct, I should direct Favardi to like take that dude out. Do I tell what is it? This leave him to me. You're missing like crazy, chick. Yeah, I was going back and watching uh, my last stream in case I'm driving any of you guys nuts. I can see that I'm missing stuff. I, I like when I go back and look, I'm like, oh, my God, right there. I should have like turned to my right and, and like opened that box, but I didn't. So I'm sorry. Is it still pointing me out of the building? Yeah. Why? I don't know. Open this door. Give me some robots. Oh, there's one over there. Unexpected. Performing an area sweep now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna engage her in this too. Yeah, I really think I should probably change the difficulty setting on this. Because, like, I'm not, like, in the least... I'm not getting damaged in the least bit. There's so much in here to, like, search. This has got to be one of the switches I need to throw. There's two more. What will happen to Miss McDonald's? Okay, so that was E1. Power to the veil? Oh, you want to talk? Where are we headed? <clears throat> I thought you wanted to talk about it. Okay. I know engaging them in conversation. Let's go in here. Self-diagnostics complete. Navigation systems operational. 
Combat systems operational. It's not the best choice. It's the spacer's choice. All oh, is this guy? Oh, yeah, it's this Jeremy. Return journey successfully completed. Spacer's Choice would like to thank you for complying with your duties. Hostile actions towards Spacer's Choice mechanics are contrary to logical directive. Conclusion All hostile auto mechanicals must be defective in compliance with Spacer's awesome. Choice policy. All defective auto mechanicals must be permanently dismantled. Please allow me to assist. Oh, thank you. Affirmative. Mechanicide protocols loaded. Mechanicide. Confirmation. <laughs> uh, confirmation granted. Go get him, Tiger. Oh, examine. Forward a copy of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering. I think it's volume three. I need something to read down in the pit. Much obligated. Oops. I meant to hit that. <clears throat> Access repaired well. Corbett just sent a team of technicians to conduct a complete refit of all our mechanicals. Every sentry and drone, it's not my place to say, but say so but doesn't this run contrary to the spacer's choice mission of being as cheap as possible just in case i'm audited i'd like to formally express how grateful i am to be part of the spacer's choice family that's just just finished a routine maintenance on our mechanical sentries i found some strange modifications to their logic model modules i haven't had time to run a diagnostic so i don't know what's been modified all i know is that these modifications were introduced in a in our recent refit company went through the trouble of refitting every single mechanical in the plant not long ago guessing this was the work of those visiting technicians i filed a report but my superior told me not to worry said the company knew what it was doing ordered me to forget about any alleged modifications to the logic models decided to do a bit of sleuthing on my own got my hands on a logic model time to do a little experimentation okay so where's that logic model, buddy? Because I need that. It's not the best choice, it's Spacer's choice. I think this was the only other exit out of this room. Did I go through this exit already? No, I haven't gone through there. Let's go up these stairs first. Because these stairs feel like a dead end to me. Or maybe not. A sprat. Maybe I'll find that logic module here. More to read. Oh. Wait, that's not the way I came up. Alright. 20 out of 70? Chester's passcode. Hang on, what? Okay, so if I find Chester's... Can you... Can you hack this? Something you need? I guess we'll talk later. I, I was wondering if you could... Okay, so I gotta find Chester's passcode. You're not Chester. Well, I guess this was the other way. You're not real. You're not real. No, 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 just leave me alone. Oh, 
I hear you, buddy. No, 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 just leave me alone. I've only found one out of three. I see a door over here. I want to check this door. All right, so this is leading away. Five out of ten. Man, this place is expensive. Whoa! Okay, hang on. You ready? You made my day. Mind the steam. You're liable to get scalded. Okay. I want to help Jeremy out. Which way are you going there, Jeremy? This is another one. I have to go back the way we came. If we send the power to Miss McDevitt, what happens to the veil? Yeah, that's the question. All right, come on, Jeremy. Open that door. What we got behind there? Good job, Jeremy. I gotta go back down to where I was hearing that voice. I can't remember the name of the guy whose passcode I was supposed to get. Let's unlock this door. I'm not sure if I was here. I gotta come back. Those things are not explosive. Let's unbar this door, too. But I think... I think I want to keep these doors closed. So that even though they're... Not barred, I'll know I haven't gone through them. Because after I search this area, I'm going back. Okay, here's the third lever. E3. I'm not sure what the ride is. All I know is the decision's final. I agree, Pavardi. I don't know what the right choice is either. All I know is I need to find somebody's passcode. Don't want to open that dang thing. I want to open that computer. Gotta check all the nooks and crannies. Wow, missing a head. That's pretty rough. I know I searched you. Searched you. Who missed that? I came from that. Didn't I? I didn't see any. I, I must have come from this way. Yep. Let's uh, see if we can turn off. There we go. It seemed like this was blocked. That could not be the reason why. Oh, workbench discovered. I don't think uh, I want to tinker with anything right now. 
And I don't think I want to open this because I think it's just right the other side here. See, it's this door right here. That would be a waste. You're not real. You're not real. Okay. Where was that ladder? You're not real. You're not real. Let's see if there's anything else on this. Maybe that guy down there is the guy who has the passcode, and I'm going to get it from him. Go away, Phantom! Okay, you clearly lost your mind. I'll take your hammer. Go away, Phantom! And just in case I have to kill you, we'll go with the shotgun. Here we go. You're not real. You're not real. Get away from me, Phantom. Shoot. Scram. Calm down. I'm not trying to hurt you. You can talk? The Phantom's never talked before. I knew I shouldn't have eaten that Sprat raw. See? See, Higgins? This is why you must always boil your Sprats before ingesting. Did that machine say Higgins' password? You're not imagining of me. Of course. Do excuse me. I experience brief flashes of mania during which I am visited by the phantoms of my imagination. Chester D. Higgins. The D stands for definitely not insane. I use it as a reminder. What is it you do? How long have you been down here? Hmm, hard to say. By my <clears> reckoning, <throat> Higgins has been here somewhere between two weeks and forever. My recollection's a touch fuzzy these days. Uh, and what exactly do you do here? Oh, Higgins has been many things over the years. Sprat Wrangler, Saltuna Critic, Aether Wave Personality, Chairman of the Board, Galactic Defender, Sisty Pig Tycoon. Sisty Pig? I've come a long way for someone who started off as a simple engineer right here in this plant. Uh, you were an engineer? Have you been surviving all this time? Jimmy'd open <clears> the vending <throat> machines. That lasted a good couple of months. Eventually, I had to resort to more unconventional means of filling my insides. Uh... This place looks like it's been a bandit weight. So you ate sprats. Braised. Boiled. Charred. Skewered. Sprats are good eating, friend. Chock full of brain food. What happened to this place? Mechanicals lost their bolts. Opened fire on anything that moved. It was pandemonium. How could this have happened? You mean, why did the Mechanicals go on a murderous rampage? Same reason any of us do, I suppose. The voice has told them to do it. I was on cleaning duty at the time. My old boss had me scrubbing pipes when the killing started. So, as usual, I missed out. <clears throat> you mentioned being an engineer. I specialized in auto mechanicals, drones, sentries. Repaired them, maintained, upgraded. Did it all from my old workroom just over in the next section. Uh Look, okay. I don't want to fall into any trouble with the mechanicals. If they <clears> wise <throat> up to our plans, they will come for us. They're all dead. Plotting irons. They're all dead. Or you can help me and I won't feed you to the sprats, your call. Ironic deaths are the worst. You made your point. I'll help you. I discovered a flaw. Their hostility levels were hardwired to maximum. There's no changing that, but you could rewrite their targeting protocol so they attack each other instead. There's none of them left. Uh, mechanicals follow the behavior of logic modules, someone tampered with it. Yes, that's exactly it. I see you're also versed in the noble art of mechanical engineering. There's a behavior control terminal in the other room. It should have options to change how the mechanicals act, including whom they shoot at. They're all dead. Oh, God, that reminds me. You'll need my passcode to access the behavior control terminal. Here, let me just write it down for you. Uh, any idea where I can find the logic module? Funny one? thing. I was working on a logic module just before the mayhem started. <clears throat> the security chief found me and confiscated the logic module. Uh, I want to ask you something. The tail. 
definitely start with the tail. <laughs> if you're feeling adventurous, the ears are a particular delicacy. Uh... Did I not I ask I specialized a... in auto mechanicals, drones, sentries, repaired them, maintained, upgraded, did it all from my old workroom just over in the next section. Okay. Okay. It would be great if it actually pointed me in the right direction. I mean, all of the auto mechanicals are killed. Which makes me think I definitely need to turn up the difficulty level in here. Uh, I think I only went up two ladders. Because I have my doubts this is pointing me in the right direction. But it could be. Was it up here? I think maybe it was up here, wasn't it? I'm going to end up searching this whole darn place. Aha, yep, this was it. Modify behavior. Like new mode. Error on the new thing. Okay. Maybe what he gave me will open, because it's got to be that one door I was at, where it was like... Uh, back this way. I think it was that... wait. No, it wasn't here. How did I miss the bathroom? Uh, I hope it's worth it. I'm running out of these things. Why the hell would somebody have a shock cannon in their locker? How did I miss that? Okay, I was there. Hold that lever. Jeremy, what's up, my bud? Mechanicide protocols currently active. Please do not interrupt. Still 33. Geothermal Security Chief's keycard. I must have missed it. Dang, I hate that. Now I gotta go through the whole darn building. I don't think there was anything in here. I hope it's in here, because I'm running out of lockpicks. That's clever. It's got to be a dead body somewhere. Perfect. I just waste all of them. And now I'm out. This, I think this door was barred from the other side before. Right. This door was barred. Yeah. 
There we go. Light machine gun? That seems kind of cool. Okay, so now... Back to that door. This is the right way? I think so. Down these stairs. Because I'm pretty sure I can't complete Die a Robot unless I do that. This has got to be where it's at. Yep, I got it. All right. Finally. It's still telling me to go to the geothermal plant. Terrific. I think I got everything. This has to be a known bug. I mean, this game is several years old. When did I say it was released? I thought I said 2019, but that seems not nearly old enough. I swear there's a way up on this roof. I do. I know. Ah, uh, forget it. I got enough crap without it. Yeah, you know what? I'll bet I checked my map and it's pointing me right back to my ship again. Why? I don't know. Alright, if I look at the journal... Oh, I gotta I still gotta go in there and divert the power. Oh man. And this is where the choice comes in. Do I send it to the Val or do I send it to the cannery? Uh here we go. I think it was it here? No, it wasn't here. It was uh I just see this big box. Um, yeah, it was straight through here. Once we do this, there's no going back. Hey, mister? Look, I know you want your power regulator and all, but I just gotta ask you. Do you understand what you're about to do? Yeah. I wouldn't mind hearing your opinion. I don't think you should cut off Edgewater's <clears> power. <throat> I think it would be cruel. I I'm sorry. That just sort of came out all at once. Edgewater's hurting. We've been losing workers year after year, and corporate hardly ever sends replacements. There's barely enough Saltuna to fill our bellies anymore. But the town's got some good people in it. Decent, hard-working folk just living uh. their lives the only way they know how. They don't deserve to be punished. Reed tells me Edgewater's going to die without workers and powers. That sure sounds like Mr. Thompson. If he was standing here, I imagine he'd remind us of how we're all one big, happy Spacer's Choice family. In Mr. Thompson's eyes, those deserters are still part of the Spacer's Choice family. <clears throat> the family <clears throat> must work together in order to survive. I hate to say it, but I think Mr. Thompson's got a point. Unless those deserters come back, Edgewater's as good as dead. Cutting off their power might be the only way. The deserters are a community. I can't just destroy Ms. what they Ms. McDevitt's built. built something beautiful. <clears throat> Somehow, she's talked the ground into giving life again. It's plain to see she's made the Vale a better place. Fed the hungry, tended the sick. Gave a home to those that had none. But Miss McDevitt delights in Edgewater's suffering. She wants to hurt the town. Do you really want to be party to that kind of hatred? Is she really? Sorry, I didn't mean to babble like that. I just... I felt like I had to say something. Really? 
I mean, wow. Thanks. I... No one's ever told me those words in that order. I think... Maybe I could go back and talk to that guy. I'm going to give it a shot. See if I could talk to somebody over there first before I do something stupid. Let's go back here. I know it doesn't... I can't, I can't fast travel there. Because... Oh, I can't fast travel here from this location. Ugh. Man. Pavardi! Alright. Damn it. I wanna... I, I wanna... I want to make the right decision. I'm lost. I don't know. You know what? Screw it. Pavardi, you said we should... I hate Spacer's Choice. <clears throat> I really don't want to... Twenty two percent redirect power. Continue. I'm going to get my my thing either way, man. Just do it. Just do it. Oh, this is awful. Fine. <laughs> did not see that lady being filled with hate. Now do I have to go and kill? Did I not get this? Bavardi, this better have been a good choice, otherwise I'm never trusting you again. Everybody, you can blame Pavardi for that choice. Let me guess, it's still pointing to the geothermal, right? Botanical lab. They gotta be pissed at me. Fast travel is open everywhere. You know what, before I do that... Let's fast travel here. <clears throat> Are you still sitting here? All right. I got your logic module. Never seen the veil lit up like this before. Bang up work, soldier. You're a credit to your uniform. Oh, that reminds me. Got to look into getting us a uniform. So this is it, then. The key to humanity's victory over the mechanical hordes. I would reward you with the gratitude of the resistance, but I'm guessing you want something tactile. That'd be nice. So here's a couple of bits for your trouble. And a little something to remember me by. Shock stick? Yeah, I'm gonna have a whole bunch of stuff to scrap. I don't think I'm going to have to go there. Hopefully I'm not going to have to go there in violence. That would suck. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm sorry. Uh. Botanical lab. Let me guess. It's pointing right back to my ship, right? Everything's pointing to my ship.
Nobody's firing on me, so that's good. Home is where the heart is. Marauders took that saying a little too literally. Deserter, deserter, deserter. Battle aid's okay. Everybody keeps staring at me. It's not my fault the power's dead. No, it's not. Whoa, Miss Parvati. Hey, you're, uh, what, um, how, how are you? Hi, 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 uh, hello. Are you, uh, uh, are things safe out here? How are you keeping? Great, just great. I've been trying to keep stuff running, just like you. Only I'm not so... Wait, they didn't kick you out, did they? Oh, gosh, no, I, I'm just along with this fella here. I've seen you wandering around here. You don't look like you're coming from town. Never heard it phrased in such a way before. I guess we're all trying to get our ships off the ground, ain't we? Sorry, I just wasn't sure if you were from town or if you were one of us. Something's been chewing at me, you see. I didn't fact see is, you I've before. Been, well, lying. To everybody here. Camp thinks I'm a mechanical genius, but I couldn't fix a busted chair. I'll take all the help I can get. I set my mind to learning the craft of the engineer, you see. I want to make something of myself. You ever heard of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering? Comes in a set of three. If I had my hands on one of those data pads, I could teach myself <clears throat> the ins and outs. I think I might have picked those, those up. Are good. My dad kept a copy <clears throat> with him when he was Sorry. the cannery. I know the old community center kept a copy. Should find another one back in town. If you could find me even one of those pads, I'd be greatly obliged. I think I found multiple of them. No kidding. Really? Well, which one? Look at that. Building a computing machine out of Spectrum Potatoes, a primer. Spectrum I'm just Potatoes. Glad survived all these years. I appreciate you going through all that trouble. In fact, I put aside something special on the off chance that somebody'd search out those data pads for me. That's so. Uh... Sure. I'd be glad to take them off your hands. What's right, on your mind? Let's see. Couple months. This camp's my home. People you see milling about, they're my family. At least I think of them that way. Uh, I feel like I shit. I life. really do. Would have died in the wilderness if they hadn't chanced upon me. I should have saved. I'm so horrible about saving. What were you doing out in the we wilderness? We all left the cannery for one reason or another. Me? I was let go. Mostly on account of my incompetence. I mean, I was incompetent. I couldn't even survive on my own. Grace found me, Adelaide took me in, I've been on my feet ever since. You weren't incompetent. You just didn't fit the cannery. Not like here. This place had a U-shaped hole, and now it doesn't. You could stay, you know. Here. I'd be happy to... I mean, uh, we could really use... Uh, oh, this isn't coming out right. Uh, if you want, Adelaide would make a place for you. Uh, let's see What's if there's, on your mind? I want to see if there's anything else. Never mind. Okay. So I did that deserter... Wait a minute, that guy said something else. Don't see why Thomas can't just get the generator up and running. Something I can help you with? Nothing. With the power gone, we've got to conserve our supplies. Oh. I don't know what you did to talk some sense into Zoe, but I appreciate it. Zoe. Deserter, deserter, deserter. I could kill them all, I'm sure of it. Sealed. Stay there, Pavardi. I need to steal.
I was stealing supplies from a group of people who can no longer survive on their own. That's not increasing my guilt at all. Yeah, don't tell me I'm a crap person, I already know. it where's where's the you see if that freaking pointer was pointing to the right place I probably would be able to like grab it with you know it would point me to where I needed to go yeah I read that okay so it's not in here Yeah, I haven't really used any Adreno at all. So the geothermal thingamabobber. Oh, I'm overweight. I can tell. Uh. Let's scrap some of this stuff. Yeah, that's garbage. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's just four. Hopefully I'm not overweight now. These things have a weight as well. Yep, now I'm back to moving normally. This looks like... Looks more like a geothermal plant than the other stuff did. Oh, could it be in here? No, I, I, I've read all of this stuff. Zoe, this is Zoe's room. Am I supposed to go back to Edgewater? I never made it up to the second floor there. I thought it said Botanical Lab. But it's... Oh. I don't know if I have to quit and restart this whole game over or what. To get it to point to the, the right place. Everything is sealed. Everything is sealed because I shut off the power. I never even came back here. Like, this whole part of the game is cut off to me. Yep. I, this, whatever was, I was. Bavardi, what have you done? That was kind of cool. I can try and head for that noise. No! Oh, cool. 
time to do a little damage. I think I've checked the whole place now. I'm gonna end up selling these, I think. One of us wanna go see what happened. I know, I'm trying to think. Didn't I already come in here? I did. I have no idea. I just did a full circle of the whole place. Come on. It's, I gotta be like missing it. Yeah, I mean like in here is where the noise is coming from. So where is that thing? I'm missing it. This looks like it still has the lights on. I don't know how hosed I am. I cause I can't even figure out. The damn thing's not pointing me to where I need to go. This looks like a sink. What is that? Gold teeth. <gasps> she stole, they stole the gold teeth from what's his name? Uh, so Emma, how do I? I, I don't. I don't know how long, how long ago was that. Yeah. Where the hell is the generator? Do I have to quit and start over? Because I don't see the generator anywhere in here. That is not the generator. It would be stupid if that was the generator. This is a grill. I mean, I would think I didn't check. Look at all this stuff that I missed. None of this is the, the generator. All right, I'm going to go back to the journal. Let's see. Convince the deserters to return. Okay. So that's what I need to do. Stand in the middle, maybe. What happened? Sprat fell into a transformer again. These guys are the deserters. Found a spoil at this rate. Can I talk to the deserters? Your wits about you, friend. What happened? Sprat fell into a transformer. I don't know again? how much longer we'll last without power. Keep your wits about you, friend. I know. I'm trying to think. Marauders can't see us in the dark. Wild canids, on the other hand. <laughs> Standing around the campfire is nice and all, until one of us starts singing. Something I can help you with? I don't know how much longer we'll last without power. Keep your wits about you, friend. Don't know how much longer we'll last without power. Keep your wits about you, friend. I don't know how much longer we'll last without power. I don't know how much longer we'll last without power. So keep your wits about you, friend. 
Keep your wits about you, friend. Keep your wits about you, friend. I don't know how much longer we'll last without power. I don't know how much longer we'll last without power. Any luck finding one of those manuals? What's on your mind? Uh... Maybe because I fast-traveled here? It turns out... If... Don't... Remember, sorry. Because I fast-traveled here? I don't know if I completely hosed it, because I should be trying to, to talk the deserters into... Oh, that, okay. Can I take a shortcut? I'm sure. That's a really bad idea. I'm I'm only let me guess, are the monkeys there? Yep, they are. All right, let's do this. Nice I didn't want to kill you monkeys, but... Jeez. Law tutorial. During your adventures, things may happen to your character that can trigger a flaw. Taking the flaw is optional, but doing so provides you with a perk. Okay. Pithicophobia. After repeatedly getting beat up by primals, you no longer function well when they attack your companions. One perk point? Yeah, sure. I'll take it. Yeah, I'll come back for the perk point. Normally, I wouldn't because I think, yeah, that's ugly. Oh. Not sure how often. Not sure often I'm gonna get hit by primals. Oh, shoot a monkey. This is what happens when you cut across the land. Can I get there from here? I don't think so. Either I go across this valley or I avoid them.
I just want to get back to the ship. And then I got to figure out... Oh, but I'll be right here. I can talk to this guy and... Uh, Right? Isn't he, like, right here? Give him the gold teeth. Hey, Miss Parvati. Lovely to see you about, Miss Parvati. Things going all right, Silas? Been keeping him careful and true, Miss. Best to ask her yourself. My dad's buried here. Silas watches over him when I get... When I can't leave the house. Oh. Well, thanks. Something I can do for you? Oh, Law, don't tell me. Marauders were serving his body as the centerpiece in their vile feasts. Did they stick a mock apple in his mouth? Uh huh. Um, note all above the teeth. Our gold teeth, Silas. I'll sell them to you. Look, just take his remains off my hands and put them where they deserve to be. I could lie. Oh, that's uncommon kindly of you. You guys are I'll in the shit. Teeth return to their place of rest. Uh, I don't know if there's yeah. anything else. Okay, I did that part. It's got to be pointing right to my ship. It is. I thought I saw something show up over there. Thing is, is uh, nothing here respawns. And none of the dead bodies ever go away, I think. Why they must, because they're not there. Yeah, it's gonna bring me like. Wow. If I've been able to get out here, I so would have stripped this for parts. And there we go. So there's, there's clearly something wrong. There's clearly something wrong. Maybe it was fast traveling? Alright, at any rate, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna quit and then we'll see what's what later on. Maybe quitting will help. Alright guys, I, uh, I think that's right here. All right. All right. I'll talk to you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed this. We'll see if we can figure the fix this. All right. Have a good day. Bye.